always the organiser Anna has decided to book us a special kids cabin. We know it's ours because there's a big cat on the side of the train. The girls love it. Which means we get a special private cabin with toys and we can relax. We've gone and done it, we're back in Helsinki. Time to find our accommodation. So we finally make it to Helsinki and Anna wants to go to a Vietnamese restaurant and we're gonna be in Thailand next week. It's right next to our car. <laughs> and the girls are going crazy all right. You guys are both thirsty. One more beer before home time. Yeah. What do we got? Mine is a dark beer made the traditional Finnish way. They hollow out a birch tree and they put juniper leaves in it and they tilt it and they pour it down the mixture and that's what filters it and gives it extra flavour and it goes into a sauna and the sauna heat is used to help boil it and ferment it and then some places even put the sauna rocks in to heat it up and to the process. This is, this is all justifying $28 for a scuba. <laughs> <laughs> not $28. <laughs> I personally really like it. <laughs> Anna's beer tastes like smoked cheese. And the guy said to Anna, how adventurous are you feeling? My answer is, we travelled all the way here from Australia. That's pretty adventurous. <laughs> sure. What are we doing today? We are doing our first free walking tour, which is weird for us because we normally do it everywhere, but we have it this trip. Just finished our free walking tour and we've popped in for some lunch in the market. I think it was a really good tour. Yeah. Guided really, really well. Very informative. When we were poor backpackers, we used to look around for the older couple to give money and then we'd give the loose change that we had. And now we're the older couple. So we could actually hand him a note, which was nice. Yeah. For our early lunch, we've got some shepherd's pie. Anna's getting her traditional salmon soup. And this delicious bread, which is uh, salt, rosemary and olive oil. And this is the best coffee I've had since Vilnius, which is saying a lot because that That's coffee delicious. was so good. So you finally had your salmon soup, how was it? It was delicious. It was so nice and creamy and lots of salmon. It's been a couple of days since we've done a kid focused activity. So we're going to take the girls to, it's called Children's Town and apparently it's a museum where they can play around in lots of different rooms. They'll really enjoy that. I've never seen a change table that provides you with nappies.
caught the metro on the way to the indoor playground, both girls fell asleep. So we can actually sit and have a coffee like functioning adults. And if we finish this quickly, we can have a wine. Oh, watch out. <laughs> Finishing up our breakfast here, we've had a rough start in the morning. The girls have been off, they didn't sleep well, which means we didn't sleep well. Yes. Anna's legs hurting from the trampoline mm -hmm. yesterday. We're in the age bracket of having a bad knee. <laughs> and um, we just had to pay 55 euros to get our washing done. That hurts. It does. First time we've had to pay for washing on this trip. Okay, so we finished our breakfast, now what? We are off to Salem Millennium Fortress <laughs> Island. I don't know how to pronounce it properly. You're on the ferry? Yeah. <laughs> nice ferry trip, nice and short. Better when it's free. Yep. We'll check out this island. a couple of times so we have to come in. It's cool. melting on the ground before but not the case now. Last snow of the holiday. I'm sad. I'm not sure there'll be much snow in Thailand. <laughs> How do you like the world's smallest lift? Oh, my knee appreciates it. Our last full day in Europe and the girls have decided they want to walk. Hello. What are we going to do for our last day? We're taking the girls to the aquarium. So we'll do something that they'd enjoy. Yeah, go for them.
we finished with the aquarium. It was fun. Now it's time for Anna's favourite pastime. Shopping. Yay! It's last drinks here in Finland, Helsinki. And it's actually last drinks in Europe. It is last drinks in Europe. So our trip may be over here, but there's no need to fret because we have one week in Thailand. <laughs> Alright, we've got a massive day here. We've got a half hour train, we're going to the airport, and we've got a six and a half hour flight to Doha. And our two and a half hour stopover has changed to eight and a half hours. And we've got another six and a half hour flight to Phuket. So it's going to take ages. But if I edit it really quickly for you guys, 